What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Gage, GB Resale King, YouTube and Poshmark, 50 Shades of Gage on eBay. It's a beautiful day to be alive. Beautiful Monday morning down here on the compound. And I got some sales going out. I did pretty good over the weekend. I still got a bunch of offers that I got on the computer. They sent offers. Some of them were too low, so I put counter offers and I'm waiting to see back. I had to decline a couple that were like pretty much insulting but anyways before I ship these that I'll go back in there and double check again see if the other ones came through that way I could ship them all out at the same time my average shipping day on Poshmark is 1.6 days it was one day but over that long weekend it extended it to 1.6 but that's still pretty good most people on shipping on Poshmark is three to five days so anyways if you could do the youtube things for me please hit that like button leave a comment down below if you want to subscribe to my videos it's totally free just click the subscribe button and then share my content click share share to your facebook tell all your friends about me all those things really help out and i'll give a shot of what i got going out thanks all right starting here i got a pair of uggs samantha boots um, I got these in a bundle of a bunch of other women's clothing, jewelry, charms, and I've already made my money back pretty much after selling two pairs of boots. These I had sold for 70. The box is 8.5. The customer told me that one is size 8 and the other one's 8.5. So she returned them. I put them back online, wrote in the description that one was a different size lowered the price a little bit and I sold these back again for $40 this is a men's triple XL John Deere motorsports jacket I paid a dollar for it I believe and I sold that for 18 bucks so that's really nice I sold another Pocky one chip challenge I bought 16 of these for $10 this is the fourth one that I've sold for $15 so Definitely made my money back on that. These are ladies. Size. Ladies 8 Skechers Go Walk Slip-Ons. I paid $2 for these. And I sold them for 12 I had them on there for 15 But she put an offer for 12 so I took it. That's really worth it. That's a good deal. These are Harley Davidson vintage enamel pins. Dad bought a whole board of them for $20. I sold these three to one customer for $13. And this one for a customer for $7. Over here, a Timex Iron Man watch. Works good. I put a new battery in it fairly recently. I sold that for eight. I think I paid a dollar for it. This bundle right here has got a Nikon Coolpix S6500 digital camera. This one's nice because after you take the picture, you can apply filters to make it look like a vintage photo or like all different filters right from the camera without having to do it on a computer or anything. So I sold that. Lime green pair of Vans, checker lime green, they got a little stain on them, I couldn't get out, but I put it in the listing. I paid five for these. These tall Vans, they're brand new. I think I paid ten for those. And these shoes for crews, brand new with stickers, I think I paid two dollars for those. I sold this bundle for $80. This is a Bush beer cowboy hat. It's made out of like the beer carton type material. I got a whole stack of these in, well, one Bush and the rest Pabst Blue, Blue Ribbon at an estate sale. I got an entire bundle of stuff plus all these really nice vintage Eddie Bauer jackets and stuff for... $25 I think 25 or 20 and anyways I sold this one 
this is my last uh, bush one but I sold this for ten dollars they're originally twelve ninety eight new this is Mary Kay time wise age minimizing 3d day cream for normal to dry skin I sold this for 12 and I got this in a big bundle a while ago of Mary Kay stuff it was I think it came out to like less than 50 cents per item when I bundled it all together and I still got a bunch of discontinued Mary Kay that's still selling these are men's size 13 vans suede and fabric they're in pretty good condition a little bit dirty on the inside but they don't stink bad they don't smell bad or anything sold those for 15 this is an under armor project rock backpack it's like a tactical style backpack it's got a spot for your water bottle nice pockets on the side chest strap it's got a pocket right here for mp3 player I paid a dollar for that and I sold that for $21 so as of right now that's what I got going out like I said I'll go in a little bit check see if anything else sold or if I have any more offers that I could accept that'll make it sold and then after that get it all shipped out get these packages on the way to their happy customers glad i have you guys along on the ride with me smash that like button leave a comment subscribe share and remember you are special you are worthy you cannot be replaced see you on the next one peace out what's going on youtube it's your boy gage it's wednesday a little bit after the morning uh, I got some sales ready to go out, so I want to give you guys a shout out the sales I got going out. And I got some sales going out. So if you could do the YouTube things for me, hit that like button, leave a comment, subscribe, share. And I'll go ahead and give you a shot of what I got going out today. Thanks. This is a men's ping jacket. Golf jacket, extra large. Really soft material on great condition. I had it on there for $20 for quite a while and nobody really put an offer or anything. So I dropped it to 16 and it sold immediately. This is a ramen t-shirt, men's small, and a pair of Birkenstock Mary Birkenstock Mary Janes and a ramen shirt. Sold this bundle for 36. These are boys size 3 Heelys. I just got these the other day for $5 and I sold these for 20. Men's size 12 Nike SB Dunks. I put them on there for 20 even though they got this discoloration and stuff back here. And somebody put an offer for 13 so I sold them. This is two Michael Kors watches. One's kind of tortoise shell, and the other one's like a white acrylic watch, lightweight. And I sold these. I think they needed batteries, or, or one of them, the white one is really dirty or something. So I, I listed them down to $9, and those sold immediately. Here's a Born Concepts wallet I just got the other day for a dollar and sold it for six. I think I had it on there for eight, but she put in an offer. This is a men's extra extra large Guy Harvey. It's in good condition, but it's got a couple pencil marks or something I couldn't get off. I had it on there for eight. The guy offered five. Five is about the lowest I'll go on any item because after Poshmark fees it's two dollars I probably paid 50 cents for the shirt so I'm still making money but yeah then this is a double double XL polo golf windbreaker 
I sold that for 15. So that's what I got going out today. Most of my sales were over the week and I'm sure everyone else's is because after people get their checks on Friday. So Friday is my Friday and Saturday are my Friday, Saturday, Sunday is my biggest sales. But Wednesday, this is pretty good for a Wednesday. So anyways, if you like our videos and you want to support our videos, the best way you can show that is hit that like button, leave a comment and subscribe. Hit the bell icon if you want to be notified of all our future videos. And we really appreciate it. Remember, you are special, you are worthy, and you cannot be replaced. Thanks for being here. Peace out.